Hello and welcome to Accessorize Your Life. I'm Julia and I have for you today my Giorgio Armani collection. This is new to me because I just saw that I wanted to try something new, something that I hadn't really tried in the makeup line, but then again, I did in the lipstick line. So I went about to collect these items. And luckily for me, Macy's and Nordstrom were having a sale at the time. So these products were included in the sale. Plus you get your star money or your notes. And I added that on and it brought my cost down. So I'm very happy about that. So let's get right into it. The first item I picked up is the new, this is actually new to me as well as to the line. This is Georgie Armani's, and I'll call it Armani for short. Their new Power Fabric Plus Foundation. It has up to 24 hour wear time. And what it's supposed to also have is an SPF of 25. So that's UVA and UVB protection. And it is the Octin 08 or OMC that's in this product that helps to filter out the sun rays. And it also is found in cosmetics to keep the ingredients fresh and effective. So it also helps skin absorb the ingredients in it. So if this is medium to full coverage, it has a natural matte finish and it comes in 30 shades. Um, it's an oil to powder foundation and my shade is 13 in this. So 13 is deep with neutral undertones. And I'll show you what it looks like on my skin really quick. Here it is on my skin. Hope you can see it right there. It's above my finger. picked up the medium to full coverage um, power fabric concealer and I got it in a shade or two lighter than my foundation I have it in number eight and it is supposed to be easy to blend and non creasing I'll show you what it looks like right below the foundation here is the wand and it has like a doe foot sort of narrow applicator so that's good and there it is right above here so right above there there it is next to the foundation the concealer and it blends out really nicely and I have to say I like the foundation as well so there they are together Next, I have the Luminous Silk Glow Fusion Powder. And this is a lightweight to sheer coverage powder. This is the case, it's pretty sleek. You kind of lift it here in the front where the little GA is. It has a mirror. And then here is the Feather Light Powder. I have it in shade 11.5. It's a setting powder and it's long wearing. And I like that it's not messy. I love a compact. Try to get enough on so you can see it on my finger and then on my hand. And where is it on my hand? It's such a good match for me. Everything is, it's right there that it's hard to see. But again, this is what it looks like in the compact. And when you flip this open, you have a brush here that comes out. Very easy to use, nice and small, tucks in easily. Okay. 
And next, I have here the Smooth Silk Eye Pencil. And I have it in number four, which I think is black. It's, I think it's a gray to black, but it really looks black. And I think there are a dozen, almost a dozen other colors, like brown, purple, green, teal, in this pencil. But this is supposed to be like silk, and it was pretty easy going on my um, eye, um, eyelid. And it enables you to smoke out the color because it has on one end is your pencil that sharpens the other end you have this smudger here that's like a little uh, sponge so you can smudge out your easy to apply eyeliner and I went for black in this I didn't want brown and then the other end has this little sponge or felt tip that you can just smudge out everything so cool Next, I have the Fluid Sheer Glow Enhancer, and I have it in number eight, which is a soft pink. And would you look at this? Can you see the light gold in here? This is a multi-purpose fluid um, sheer enhancer for your face. You can use it as a blush, a highlighter, or a bronzer if you get in a color that'll work for you as a bronzer, the deeper shades. But I am interested in getting number 11, Golden Bronze, because I think that would look good too. This is a little light, but it, it works. It works for me. I like it. And it comes in seven shades, and you get 18 milliliters in it. Oh, I should show it to you. It has a pump, so you have to be careful, because you do get a lot out. I tried to go light, but still I got a lot out of it. There it is, and it's kind of runny as you can see. So it's kind of viscous. And you spread it out, and it gives your skin just this radiancy, this luminosity. And it's pretty, very pretty, even in such a light shade on me. Okay, next I'm going to go into what started all of this for me. It was all about this. This is why I delved into this line. Because, let me tell you a backstory. I first got the Sicily and the Sicily had this beautiful ombre liquid eyeshadow. And uh, let me see if I can get the right name for it. Yes, it's the Ombre Eclat Liquid Eyeshadow from Sicily. So I first got this one and then I heard that there were some better ones out there. There were some that people were liking a little bit better, although this one was rated number, um, rated high, this number five was. And um, I ordered it before knowing that it was rated highly, but the other colors didn't get such a great rating, but this one did. But they also said that there were some other ones out there like Giorgio Amani that were really good. And I figured this would be great for, this type of eyeshadow, a liquid one, would be great for days that I work, that would stay on my eyelids longer because I have oily eyelids. So I went all in and I got four of these Giorgio Armani Eye Tint Silk um, colors. So these colors, these satin eye colors, come in a matte finish, a shimmer finish, and a metallic finish. And I'm going to start with the one I picked up in matte, and it is number 24. And this one is Nude Smoke. So it's more or less like a sand nude color. But I want you to see the Doe Foot Applicator. It's almost like a teardrop. So this pointed end can fit right in the corner of your eyes and just sheer out this um, eyeshadow very well. So this is my first shade, and here it is. And it is a matte, and again, it is Nude Smoke, number 24. Next, I picked up number 10, which is like a brown. It's called Sin So, and this one is a shimmer. It is gorgeous. It gives you a little more intensity, and you can wear these together if you'd like. So number four 
I mean, number 10 is there, intensity. I'm trying to do the best I can, right there. Very pretty. And I'm going to come over some with the next one. The next one is a shimmer also. It's number 27 and it's Sunset. It is gorgeous and this one is a red purple. Right there. Very pretty, a red purple. And the last one I have is a metallic finish and it's number 53, it's even better. It's all kinds of yumminess because it's so intense, it's so rich, it's just mm, gorgeous. And there it is. It is a dark purple and it's called Gar Cone or Garconi, I'm not sure. Next thing I picked up, that's it with those eyeshadows, is the Black Ecstasy Total Effect Mascara. Now this is supposed to be lightweight, yet lengthening and giving you vol volume and curl. That's a high order, but you know what? I like it, I think it does pretty close to that. I got it in number one and it's obsidian black and it's about 10 millimeters or 0 .0, 0 0.33 ounces. But you know it's all about the wand, right? The formula has to be good but the wand or the brush has to be even better and this delivers. And next we get into what I picked up first. Now I have one that I probably you didn't see a picture of and it's, mm, it's my latest purchase. And this is the new Lip Mastro. It's from their Mediterranean uh, Liquid Lipstick Collection and I have it in 215 Sun and this one is like a rose to me, a matte rose. There it is. But it has some sheen to it, kind of glistens, doesn't it? Okay, I think I picked this one up even before I picked up the last three that I'm going to show you. This one is this one, gosh, I'm trying to remember. This one is 504 Flirt, and this is a lip power. It's a long-lasting satin lipstick. And you, there it is. Very pretty. And it's just deeper than the one I pre previously showed you. There it is. Gorgeous. are the three items I picked up um, as Christmas was rolling around. I couldn't get the the Chanel little pouch, but this was available. I lost it. I had Chanel in my cart, lost it, and this is what they did have. And I'm very happy with this, as a matter of fact. The price was good, and all three of these colors are fantastic on my lips. So I have here three beautiful colors. Let's see, this peachy brown here is called Granite, and this is in 101. I'm gonna swatch it on the other hand. 101. Gorgeous. There that is. The next color I have here is a deep brown, and it's 209, and it's called Palazzo. Like I said, there wasn't a bad one in the bunch with these. This was a good set and great for the money. Great for the money. I'm so happy they had it. Isn't that beautiful? All of these work so well with my skin tone. And the last little mini that I got in here from the holiday collection is 405 Sultan. And Sultan, 
Mm, watch out, watch out, watch out. It's what's on my lips right now. It's a red. Gorgeous. There's not a bad one in this bunch. Guys, I am so happy that I delved into Giorgio Armani. These products so far have just been a delight to use. Lightweight, very easy to apply. I think what I want to pick up next is a bronzer and I think another concealer. If I don't find the bronzer in my complexion, I'll go with a concealer in the deepest shade Then I'll have that. And I would like to see a brow uh, product from them. I'll continue to pick up the lips and definitely I want to pick up the eye tints. Gorgeous, gorgeous products. Thank you for watching. I hope you will come back and watch all, all my other videos. If you're new here, yeah, go watch my other videos and give this one a like and subscribe, why don't you? It's free, it's fun, I think so. And uh, if you've used any of these products, let me know down in the comments. And if you like anything that I've shown you here, let me know also in the comments. Well, that's it. I'm gonna wrap this video up. I don't want it to be too long. I wanted to share with you my new collection of Giorgio Amani products. Bye bye for now.